Imagine yourselves back through the mists of time uh, in March 1980. Uh, you're in here about to watch the very, very first performance ever in the history of mankind of pulp. Are you there? Are you feeling it? <laughs> This is the secondary school that I went to between the ages of 12 and 18, I suppose. And I've come back today to talk about this book of my lyrics. Gotta be the only one thing's wrong. She quotes Shakespeare all day long. Said, baby, why ignoring me? She said, to be or not to be. I played the first song that I ever wrote, which was awful. Shakespeare Rock, it's called. Shakespeare Rock. And just use that as an example of how um, when you first start writing songs you don't really know what to write about. The other way you can go is try and write about the whole state of the universe in one song. Um, which I'll play you a tiny bit from this other song, which is too embarrassing to play a lot of. It was a song called Life is a Circle. It's a very serious song. Um, let's see if I can remember how it works. Life is a circle, you're caught on. Life is a road that's much too long It winds, goes ahead It only stops when you're dead <laughs> I'll spare you the rest of it. Well, my message was hopefully a positive message, is, which is that... Um, <laughs> which is that... Uh, you know, everybody's, people kind of try and um, fight to, to, to get an angle on things, but everybody's already got a unique viewpoint just through accidents of birth and stuff like that. And really, the, the, key, the trick is just to recognise that, not to discount your own experience and think that you're not official enough or proper enough. In a way, it wasn't until I'd moved away from, from Sheffield and from here, that all those kind of normal things, suddenly they weren't normal anymore because I wasn't seeing them every day. And so then I realized they were interesting. And I think that's, for me, that was one of the key things to, to realize that um, just cause something to you seems super normal and maybe a bit boring or whatever, to somebody else, it will seem exotic cause they're not living the same life. As, a, as an example of what I've just been talking about, this, this next song that I'm going to play here uh, was the first song that really got us any attention. Again, it was written when I was in London. I should point out as well that this song has got the same chords as the silly one about Shakespeare, which uh, again goes to prove something. If only I could think of what it was. Well, it happened years ago When you lived on Standard Road Listen to your sister When she came home from school She was two years older And she had boys in her room now I'm going to the library, the school library, because I'm going to present them with a copy of my book to put in there for people to deface. And, um, but I also have these books which uh, belong to this school, which I uh, naughtily didn't bring back, so I've got that one. That one's quite interesting. So look, it's, got a, it's actually got a pulp um, flyer, a very small flyer inside it. Um, yeah, so I'll take him back and see what the fine's going to be like. Oh, well, I heard her. All right. Oh, I want to take you home. I want to give you children. You might be my girlfriend. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello. Hello, Mr. Cooker. Hello. I've got. Oh, there's more than one. Yes, I know. I've got a confession. Yeah. So. Do you know? I don't. I don't do fines, but if I did, <laughs> you'd owe me quite a bit of money. I know. I won't be stood here if you. If you. I know. Mind. Yeah. Well, I won't be stood here. Right. <laughs> well, listen. Oh, we were on the bed when you came home. I heard you stop outside the door. I know you won't. Believe it's true, I only went with her Cause she looks like you, my God Quite cool. Um, it's got a good story to how we started and things. So. Yeah, all right actually. It seemed to go okay. Oh, very nice. <laughs> I thought it was funny and good. I thought it was funny. <laughs> it's hilarious. <laughs> I'm really glad that I did it. So, I still, you know, I think that's where interesting things come from. I guess that's because it's my background, so I, I remember it. I've got fondness for it, but um, I don't know. Them kids have got like some. Got a bit of got a spark of magic there, and I and I just wouldn't, you know, it's nice if you can think that that's they're going to do something with that, you know.